Hello everybody. So I'll be showing us how to make night renders with V-Ray for Revit. To, to start, let me first render the scene as it is now. So we know how to start on the night render. Okay, we can see our scene is uh, in the morning view. So, we stop that. Minimize this. <coughs> yeah. What you do now is go to your dome light. And because the HDR image we are using actually has a very bright sky, which is meant for the uh, morning view. So, we are going to change it to another is there that has a night view so here are a list of HDR skies that I have here you can see number one two three four five six seven eight nine nine is getting darker then ten is dark also so we are going to use number ten which is this number ten to open so it's loaded now once it's loaded what you do next is you decrease the intensity of the sky you don't want it to be so powerful again you don't want it to just bring out the brightness of the sky we want a night view so we have to reduce it so i'm putting 20 here now to with 20 let me reduce this so i'll be faster Render. So you can see we have our view in a kind of um, night, evening kind of atmosphere, the kind of environment is looking, is having a nice feel. So, with that, I'll stop this because I'm not yet satisfied with um, the night view I'm getting. So, minimize this. You go to the exposure. So, on the exposure here, we'll drag this down to average daylight. So, I've reduced the white balance to average daylight. Here yeah, is still on sunshine. It's okay, but we'll have darkened. <clears throat> the white balance and we have already darkened the dome light too so we can check to see what we have now It's looking nice now. It's looking nice, almost the way we want it to look. So what we do again now is um still kind of bright at the background. So you can still go ahead and reduce this to zero point five, and let's see if it's not going to be too dark. super dark super super dark so i guess you just have to make do with 10 
okay it's cool like this it's cool it's cool so the last thing we'll do now is if you are satisfied with what you have stop the rendering then you go to dome light and click on this drop down so wait for the hdr image preview to load so you see the background these are hdr sky background now so you can actually rotate it to wherever you want to wherever you want the sky to show to reflect on the background so you can see because we're here somewhere here before so we still have some kind of light at the background so i'm going to move it over over here yes so we'll check that out so you see that the background position is going to change it's going to change now can you see that so we have a different background now so that's how you rotate the background it is actually like a 360 kind of background so you can it's rotatable you can rotate it so i think i prefer this okay so the last thing you have to do is to just turn back the lights on so once you have done that you can now have your render So take note that whenever you are making a night render uh, for your models, you have to um, kind of like put some lights, put some lights in the building itself, like your some ceiling lights. You understand? So at least some lights can glow out of the uh, of your window. You understand? So with that now, I'm going to stop this now. I hope you understand how to achieve your night renders now. So you can stop this. And uh, thank you for watching this.